Yep. So that's what happens when we fail. Cows are gone to get ducted. And there goes Romani. Oh shoot, that's bad. That's very bad. We failed. Unbelievable. Yo, what's up? What's good in the hood? Right here in LA. Plane, Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. I hope you guys are having a wonderful morning. It is 5.26 a.m. Man, we have a lot of editing to do, a lot of work to do. But we are here delivering some more Majora's Mask content. I hope you guys enjoy. And what am I doing just fooling around? Well, in the last episode, remember Romani told us to meet us at her ranch at 2 a.m. at night. Well, 2 at night, actually. And we're just killing time, we're waiting, we're waiting. And we did do the, the horse race and we did get the mask here. Now, this errand or this little side quest requires two days actually. The first day is what you saw <laughs> of me failing. Uh, we gotta kill those things and we gotta make sure we hold them off till morning. And the second day, well, you guys will find out later. I'll tell you guys more about it later. So there is Romani. It's almost time. I forgot that she called me Grasshopper, but there we go. Out we go. Let's do this. And they're coming. So yeah, all we gotta do is hold them off till morning. They hate the sunlight. These are the things responsible of giving the ranch a hard time, abducting cows, and just making things impossible for this ranch to produce milk. We need some good quality Romani ranch milk. So all we gotta do is take them down. We gotta make sure these guys don't hit the barn. I think they go behind the bar or just don't let them near the barn period. So that's exactly what we got to do. Just shoot them. And there are... Well, l let me tell you the reason why I failed the first time. I failed because there's actually one behind here. They pop out from behind. So I would really suggest you just turn around and just pay attention to your map. That's, that's one of the things. I wasn't paying attention to my map. But yeah, the white uh, little cursor or little... Yeah, those white dots on your map is actually the enemies. So if you see one popping behind you, as you can see, there's one moving behind me. Yeah, it's starting to move behind me. So I'm going to go ahead and turn around and make sure it does not get near the barn. And it, if, if one of these things do... Uh, well, yeah, if one of these things do hit the barn, the cutscene plays just like you saw in the beginning of the video. So that's what you don't want. All right, so we got that. It's four. It's almost sunrise. And one thing I, I do suggest that this is where I messed up too. Do do make sure that you stop uh, or actually play the the uh, the I think it was the song of time. Yeah, play that. Play the song of time backwards and return the flow of time back to normal. If you slow it down, then. <laughs> Things will actually be bad for you. That's that's exactly what I forgot to do. And I was waiting for a long time. I was like, damn, why am I waiting for a long time? And you were like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What the hell? <laughs> time has slowed down. So, yeah, just return the time to normal. As you can see here, we did it. We got rid of them. And there we go. 
Thanks to you, cows are giving thanks. Here's Romani's thanks. I think we get another bottle. There we go. That should be bottle number three, I believe. It should be bottle number three or four. I, I don't know. But yes, it will recover five hearts. It's good. It's very, very good. But um, I don't think we get the chance to use it. And there is one errand complete in our notebooks. And now what we got to do. Uh, let's, oh, okay, it's locked from the inside. Uh, let's see, let's see. We got to wait till the second day. So let's just mess around a bit. Get some, uh, see if we can find a, a heart in the little patch of grass. Let's see if we can find some, oh, 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 screen getting smaller. It's time entering the second day of dawn. That way we can go ahead and clear the Romani Ranch missions. There's 48 hours remain. That's exactly what you want. And I think what we're going to do is just go inside. Let's go inside. Uh, let me take a sip of water here. <laughs> I do have a slight uh, scratchy throat too. <clears throat> All right, we're good. We're good, we're good. Uh, let's get <laughs> I love doing that. I really, really love doing that. All right, enough messing around. Let's head in here. Let's talk to the sisters. There is Mama's house. Uh, uh, well, wait a minute. I think they're in the barn. I don't think they're in here. Nope, they're not. Yeah, they're in the barn. Yeah, nice room, though. Nice room. Reminds me of the day I, when I took uh, a week vacation to Solvang. Man, that place was nice. It was so nice. I enjoyed it. Alright, now let's head over here. Inside the barn. They should be in there. There it is. There they are. Okay, let's talk. Oh, oh my, hello. Romani's going to take our milk to Clocktown 2. You're looking after the place. The cows will be all alone otherwise. Yes, sister. I'm going by wagon into town. Would you like a ride? I'll be leaving about 6 o'clock this evening. Oh, okay. Yeah. So this is the second uh, second mission here for the Romani Ranch. And what we're going to do is... going to fast forward time here. Alright, I'm pretty surprised I played that right. I always have to go to the menu and just check how you do it. <laughs> so yeah, we're going to proceed to the night. And there we go. Now it's evening. The wagon. There it is. There she is. And I'm going to slow the flow of time. Yes. I mean, I could have just. I could have left it like that, but again. I'm going to check something around here. Uh, okay, never mind. I, I thought it would be like a, like a chest. I, I don't know why. Uh, okay, let's talk to her. Oh, good evening. I'm going to town now to deliver milk. Yes, I would like a ride. Let's do this. That's great. Tonight, I'm kind of lonely. I welcome company. All right, let's head on. That's a beautiful horse. Goodbye, Epona. I'll come back for you. I guess it's been a while now since our father died. I'm trying to take care of the ranch, but things have been getting unsafe lately. I think it said unsafe. Yes, of course Romani has been worried. And there is ghost. We should, I mean... You should thank us. We saved your cows. Romani was telling the truth, of course. 
Alright, off we go. In town I have a friend. Her name is Andrew. Andrew, the day after Ooh, the day after tomorrow's her wedding. I wonder if it will fall, that thing. It will. It will fall. Okay. Okay, okay. What? The road. Boy, get your bow ready. Oh, what's going Oh, I remember what happens. Yeah. So we're gonna have to protect the wagon from uh I don't know if it was the brothers or just two uh weird enemies that that just pop out chasing us. First milk road is blocked by a boulder and now we have to take this detour through ugly country. Are you ready, boy? I'm going... <laughs> no, I'm not ready. Okay, she's going to try to get us through here as fast as she can. Any pursuers come from behind, chase them off with their arrows. They may... Oh, yeah. They may be after the cargo. So, the pursuers are going to be after us, obviously. And we cannot let them near the cargo. There they go. And since the aiming here is ass... Let's see if I fail. All you gotta do is just, just press B. Keep pressing B and hope for the best. <laughs> try to work with it, you know. Try, try to work with the aim. So far, so good. I mean, I'm doing good. And then one thing I've learned about the pattern, once they scream, whoa, like Crash Bandicoot. Fucking Crash Bandicoot. Once they scream like that, they're ready to attack. As you can see there, they attacked me twice. It will be a bad day if, if we fail this. There you go. Freaking Crash Bandicoot and Zelda in Majora's Mask. Wow! Wow! All right, we made it. Wow, that was that was nice. We made it. Nice. Good job, Link. Good job. There it is. Mr. Barton was happy to get his milk. And of course, I was pretty cool. And there it is. We got the Romani's mask. We need that. We actually need that. Alright, that mask is only given to a limited number of adult customers. It's proof of membership. And there we go. We guarded the ranch's milk. That was added in our notebook. And it's over. That's all you have to do. The Romani Ranch. The help is now complete. We got our horse back, we got the mask. Let's see how many masks we have. We're doing great, actually. And I, I do believe that we need all the masks to progress to the to the final boss of the game. I think you need all of the masks. I mean, it doesn't matter if, if you like, I mean, you can get all the heart pieces and stuff. Um, you don't have to. If you want to, go ahead. But the mask, I think collecting all six, I, I don't know if it's 16, no, no, it has to be more than 16. But yeah, you got to collect all the masks in order to progress. Alright, so we're going to go to Clock Town. And we're going to do something real quick. I don't remember getting the, the rupees up here. Eh, just for the hell of it, why not, you know. Get, get yourself a hundred rupees. Uh, let's let's do the gold. See, I have the habit of, of pressing A. Like just like come on, let's do this quick. And I I, I press A once the the code is displayed for you to uh to for you to actually put. 
and it just bang <laughs> it hits the it, it's wrong so I have to do it all over again or again just keep pressing a just because I want to do things like quick like come on come on let's do this right, I'm gonna get the bunny ears just to swim fast get to swim fast by the way, I am a little sick. I just barely coming off a, a sore throat. Um, it's not. Trust me, it's not COVID. I mean, I did have COVID before, but it's it's not COVID. It's just like a little cold. No flu though. No nothing. It's just sore throat. I am having runny nose. So please forgive me if you do hear me cough and blow my nose. <laughs> trying my best. I'm trying. My best. So, we got silver rupees, that's 150, screw that spider or scutella, let's keep it going, and I think that will be it, I'm just going to go ahead and deposit these, play the song of time, and we're going to head to, um, we're not going to head to the next uh, temple yet, or the next dungeon. The next one will be the Great Bay, and that's gonna, uh, that should be, maybe that should be the last one? No, there's actually four, so there's actually two temples to actually clear. Once we clear the third one, we're close. We're very, very close on finishing the game, but there's still a lot of side missions for me to do. But yeah, we're not going to go to the Great Bay yet. We're going to do something fun. Just a little, uh, little Halloween tribute. Halloween's coming up, and it kind of gives it that vibe. So you guys will see on the next episode, actually. So let me go ahead and deposit the rupees. Take a look. Got a thousand two hundred and fifty. We're gonna deposit a hundred and fifty. There you have it. Yes. Boom. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> I didn't deposit a 10? No. Okay, that was a, a, a silly me. What a fail. Alright, here, take the 10. And now we're going to play the song of time. Just to reset it back to day one. Do -do -do. Now we play the song of time, and we're going to return back to the first day of dawn. <laughs> 